Hi, I'm Laura. I'm an occupational therapist in the assistive technology lab at Craig Hospital. And today I want to show you some options for controlling your computer mouse with head movement. I think a good place to start is with a free option. Sesame Enable is one of those options. You can download this right to your computer. And then when you start the program, it uses your webcam to read the position of your head. And then you just use movement to control it. You can also change a lot of things in terms of the way that it clicks. So as I hover my head, it'll pull up a little click menu. So there I could choose right or left click, or I could exit out of that. Another similar mouse is the Smile Mouse, that's S-M-Y-L-E. And with that, you get a free trial of the product. And it also uses your built-in webcam to read the position of your head to move the cursor. And with that one, you use facial gestures, such as a smile, to perform clicks or other functions on your computer. With the Head Mouse Nano right here, you use a reflective dot that you would place on your forehead or on your glasses or on the brim of a hat for it to read the position of your head to move the cursor on the screen. If you wanted to adjust the sensitivity of this mouse, or the other mouse options that I described. One option would be to go to the computer settings on your Windows computer and change the cursor speed. So if you want it to be a little bit easier to move, so if you have a little bit less head movement maybe, you would make it faster, so the cursor speed faster, so it's more responsive. With this mouse, you would also use a dwell clicker to select an item. So you would hover over the dwell clicker on the screen to choose what you want to click, left click, double click, drag or right, and then you would hover over the item you want to select. The Kuha Zono is another head mouse option. This is a gyroscopic head mouse, so you would put this on your head, and then you would click in a similar way by hovering over an item to select it. They also have an option for add-ons that would include a way to click using a sip or a puff or an external switch. If a head control mouse isn't right for you, you could also use a mouth controlled mouse. There's also a lot of different options for these kind of mice. This is one of them. This is a quad joy. So with this one, this part is a joystick. So you would put your mouth on the straw here to move the cursor as a joystick. And then with the straw, you would either sip or puff in it to click. Another option that's mouth controlled that would be good, especially if you're a gamer as well. This is compatible with a lot of gaming systems as well as your computer. So this is called a quad stick. So you would put this mouse on a mount similar to this one, and then you use a mouthpiece like this to perform clicks, and then you also move it as a joystick to move the cursor on the screen. The best way to find out what mouse works best for you is to really try it for yourself and see how it feels. Um, and that's something we can help with here in the Assistive Technology Lab at Craig Hospital. Mm -hmm.